Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World The Game, episode 4,562,371. I don't think we'll ever get up to that. I will be amazed if we do. Be so good if we got another Jurassic World app game, or, or, or just another Jurassic World game. It doesn't have to be an app game, but you know, Lydia, something. You can make, like with all these models, make like a first person shooter where you go around and shoot Ichthyostega or uh, what's the one I get loads of that I hate? The, um, oh, Microbosaurus is it? Yeah, that one, I hate getting that one because it's like the cheapest. But in this game, there is news. Wait, what? Huh? No, oh my God. Oh my God, it, no, it's gone. No way! Oh, that's okay. Right, this last night I was on this, and I got two things to redeem. It was thank you for your patience, and it was two. It was um, it was a super. It was super DNAs, and there was a uh, Yuko Yuko and something else. And I was like, you know what? I'll save that for the video tomorrow. Gone, gone now. I, I, God damn, and now I, I get 50 bucks. I would rather have the super DNA if I'm gonna be honest. Um, but actually, yeah, I, the reason why I know it's changed is because this is updated, because now we've got something else. So, the VIP bonus for a limited time for VIP players receive four times loyalty points on everything for a whole week. Um, you know what? That's pretty good. Also, exclusive VIP rewards. VIP players can claim this honorary VIP reward for today only. What what does that even mean? What, what what do you get? What do you mean? Is it is it like, oh, just today, so it's a 24-hour thing, and what do you get? 500 VIP points, which I'm guessing would be 2,000, I assume, some books and DNA, uh, I'm guessing a silver and a uh, gold mod, as well as a VIP celebration pack. Uh, all stars return, find one of these legendary creatures in every pack, and what is this? Ready to go. Creatures with no hatching required are available now in this special offer. Ooh, so how'd you get that? Is that just a join thing? So, no hatching required if you spend 100 pounds! Come on, Lydia! This is getting ridiculous. A hundred quid?! Can we can we just think about that for a second? How much is a hundred quid? Like, what can you buy for a hundred quid? If I look at these rewards, right? Okay, a level ten Enosaurus. That's all, and no hatching required. For but is that just for Enosaurus, or is that just for every? Uh, like, how, what does that mean? What do you mean no hatching? Does that mean just on him or forever, on all dinosaurs? Because if that's the case, that I can sort of see why it's a hundred quid. But, like, I wouldn't even... I'd rather buy a sausage roll from Greg's than buy this thing. <laughs> I'd enjoy it way more. Mmm, <laughs> salty and lovely. Ooh. Ooh, no, don't get me thinking. Greg's, oh, what's the dirtiest thing you can get from Greg's? If you don't know what Greg's is, it's like a pastry chain, like a... Like, imagine McDonald's, but for pastry. So sausage rolls, pies, that kind of thing. But the, the, the grimmest and nicest thing that they make is a... Is it, it's a bean and cheese uh, pasty. I think it might be sausage. Sausage, bean, and cheese pasty. So imagine beans, so like Heinz beans, with some cheese melted on there, and uh, sausage chopped up in a pasty. Oh, it's like the grossest but nicest thing ever. <laughs> I've had that plenty of times from a night out, that's for sure. Uh, but actually, that's not what I'm here for, is the Craig's pasty, although I really want one now. And uh, what's this? Earth shattering. Compete in a battle to unlock new land creatures. Ostrophagus. No! Everyone has this thing. It's the worst carnival. Um, but it's gone the thing that I was wanting to show you. But that's okay, because we're going to unlock it. I hope. We have 9,000 bucks. Hopefully we have enough bucks. Uh, I'm assuming it'll take me down to like 5,000 or something. So these are the new packs. Um, again, half the prices of all of them. You, you will make a profit. Trust. Like, you, you, like that's the thing. You're not losing. Like, the thing with you know, paying for things is that the company loses stuff, right? So I'm selling shoes and I bought the shoes for what so much money, so I have to sell them for more money. Whereas with this, it's the it's the best like marketing tactic I can ever think of. Because 
you're not losing anything. All you're doing is giving tiny little kilobytes of data. Is, it, is that the smallest one? I don't know. Of data to a, a player's account and then making money from it. No wonder, like, these app games make millions. <laughs> you think about it, like a hundred quid. For getting your source and you get it instantly for no hatching. I don't care. I'd rather wait. <laughs> but what do you get in it? So they changed them so they're no longer legendary packs or whatever they were called twin packs or whatever they're now just called legendary hybrid packs like i'm guessing that symbol means you get hybrids so you have 50 percent chance of getting 500 bucks 50 percent of 500 bucks and i think that should be the same i don't think you should put food or coin in that at all uh, and you have a chance of getting a hybrid but to be fair it is only two percent to get one of these is eight 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 15, 15, 15, and 15. So they're saying that Shinosaurus, Prion Sutures, and Dimetrodon are better than, or at least are rarer than T-Rex and Tyrandon. Actually, T-Rex and Tyrandon are the best ones here. Because they each, I think Tyrandon has a hybrid, doesn't it? And T-Rex definitely does. So they're the best ones to get there. But really, if you were to get one of these, get Pritrodon. Or Ostopus. No, get Ostoposaurus. Ostoposaurus is better. Pritrodon's really good, but for the sake of it being that water. I also would not suggest buying any of these. Good lord, no. So what we are here for, yes, is we got in the hatchery. Yes, look! The Cenozoic update buff nerf slash just general overhaul has been released. So now I don't think we have a single creature that is uh, bronze or rare. They're all super rare or higher. So super rare, legendary, and some things have been turned into uh, tournament creatures, some things have been turned into VIP creatures, I think. I could be wrong. We'll have a look through. I'll also have a look through my VIP packs as well. Uh, to see if anything's changed in there. 10,000. Fantastic. What do we have? Pterodactyl is awesome. Any, any updates? Any new things? Oh, there it is. Pa that was the one. I told you to get that. However, the video did go up just before, just after the update. So that's a bit of a shame. So I hope if anybody did, I managed to get loads uh, or like stockpile a few of them. But it seems like Panthus is the best one. And how many, how many Panthus just do I do? We'll go, we'll go and see. Let's go, 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 We're going here. So yeah, Phosphoracus. Megaloceros was a rare. Uh, Ermatherium is now a legendary. Um, so Andrusar just was a rare. To pro so I'd love to see how these, how these battles, like you, if you remember what the lineup was, oh, it's going to be crazy to see what changed. So Klenikin turned into a tournament. Smilodon turned into a tournament. Mega Theorem turned into a tournament. My only issue is I really, 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 really hope that we don't have to unlock these once I hatch it. It's like, oh, you can't get any more. You need to unlock it. Because uh, I technically already have it. And I got loads of Arctodus. I got, I bought a few of those, I think. Uh, Titanoboa, I've already got. Urnatherium, was that a, was that a rare? No, I think that was always a tournament. Um, Brontotherium was, Gigapathus was, that one I, I still don't have, I missed out on that. Um, I should have bought a Gastornis. In fact, no, I think Gastornis was always that, wasn't it? So this is the new one, the Ark of Fivichun, that one. So in comparison to a Megastorchus, it has, what, 600 extra health? Almost 600. Like, what is it, 553, 593 health extra, if we want to be pedantic. Uh, <laughs> but, again, half the attack, so... <laughs> oh god, choke and die. Um, the Megastochus is actually better. For me, because I like attack more. Um, other things that have been absolutely nerfed is the poor Mammotherium, the poor baby. But this Smithoceros has turned into a legendary hybrid. It used to just be a super rare. Um, I think the Indracoceros actually got a really good deal out of it. Um, don't know about the prices. I don't know what the prices have changed to, but Smithoceros is really good. Um, so we need, we want to get this guy. Um, so we need level 40 Amphicoon, level 40 Arcatherium. Now, if we put in... Um, a couple more, because I've already got them. So there's Arcatherium. Um, we'll go and get another Arcatherium. Oh, no. Oh, God. It's 100, 100, 100, 100. So this is, I think, going to be enough. To, if I put all the incubators in. Actually, sod that. What, if I'm just buying them instantly, you don't spend books. Jesus. Also, they've given the option to watch adverts to speed it for 10 minutes. Um... Really, I think it needs to be scaled. I don't I don't think there's any reason to run <laughs> 10 minutes on a on a six hour is nothing. 
Oh my god. Um, so yeah, we might as well just do that. We saved 10 bucks. Um, so we need to get four more of these, because I think I have seven now, and they're all level 10s. Love that background, I never see it. Um, we should get points for, or something for spending books. That would be quite nice. And there's another one. I love how, since I made the video of the, there is no reason to get VIP. It's, it's worthless, it, you know, you're just throwing money away. Um, now Lydia like, okay, well, how about we make an event that they get four times? And how about that there's a special thing? How about we make more creatures VIP? I don't think I've ever seen this thing eat. Ooh. Isn't that crazy that that was a pig and a killer pig? Did it evolve from Deprot- was it Deprotodon or...? There was another killer pig. I don't think this one was the, the scariest one. So of course it's gonna cost, you know, that's 30 bucks a pop. So we gotta get this level 40. Um, and I'm hoping- I'm actually- oh, I almost, almost clicked advert there. I'm hoping that there is also- uh, oh my god, that's 30, 60, 90. That's almost 100 bucks just on that. Just on that. But luckily, Really, it's it's in the grand scheme. I do have nine thousand, so it's all right. It's all right. We'll do this. Get this guy. Hopefully, first time. No, but halfway. That's that's decent. I'll take it. Uh, come on. Yeah, there you go. Only sixty bucks. It is a super rare, so we probably have a high chance of getting it first time. Uh, we're just gonna level up you, and you. I've just come off doing my Japanese. I I used to for the longest time. I'm I'm. Doing Pimsler. Now, I used to do Rosetta Stone, because that's from what I'd heard and from the adverts that I'd seen. I think that's the one that's most common for people to go to. Um, but at the same time, um, I didn't really... I liked it, because it was the only one I tried. Whitney had tried... Um, uh, what's that one? Uh, the one with the owl, the free, the free app. Um, Duolingo, that's it. She tried Duolingo, and I was watching her... Um, like learning Japanese and I was just thinking it's it's all trial and error That's all it is on Duolingo, but I was thinking Rosetta Stone's way better like, it, it is way better than Duolingo because for one it's not free um, And then I was talking to somebody I met when I went to Gamescom and she uh, why would it, why sell on the left? That's no, I don't want to sell them. I've spent all this money getting them. Jesus Oh, look at that. He's actually got terrible, terrible attack and health for a super rare. Even you compare that to, like, a regular creature. Um, but anyway. Uh, and she, she, like, she knows so many different languages. Uh, like, Japanese, Chinese, Korean. Um, and she speaks English perfectly fine. And I was, I, so I was like, okay, right, I'll ask her, what, what's the best app to use? She said, don't use Rosetta Stone. She said, don't use Duolingo. She said, use, use Pimsleur. Oh, no, she didn't say Pimsla, actually. I, I'd i already looked into it myself, and I thought Pimsla's better, because somebody... I, I I watched the Game Grumps, and I know Aaron's learning Japanese, and he said Pimsla's apparently much better. I was like, oh, okay, I'll check this out. I did one of the free lessons, and I was like, whoa, this is way better. Um, and then I asked her, so is Pimsla better? And she said, oh, yeah, do Pimsla. Uh, I, I still don't know how she learned it. <laughs> That's all. And I, I should have said, but how did you learn it? I forgot. Um, I was preoccupied. Um, but yeah, I've been doing it for about three months now. And I've got to admit, it's so it's like an audiobook, but through conversations and stuff. I, I, I've got the phrase, Shige no kai wa kita kurasai, just like nailed into my head, which is just listen to the following conversation. <laughs> um, so I know, how, I know what that means is because I hear it all the time. But I'm now on to like phase two, so level two, because I've completed level one. And the thing was with Rosetta Stone, I've learned a lot, but what I've learned is just random stuff. And I was talking to somebody else who did Duolingo, and she learned how to say tiger, or like the tiger is eating or something like that. And I, I was just like, like there's gotta be very rare circumstances that you learn that, like where to use tiger is eating, or like, you know, tiger. like. You, I, I know Uma, which is horse. I know Neko. I know, um, I was going to say Shen. No, that's, that's French for dog. Um, I was going to say doggo. <laughs> dog is like, I'm, I'm blanking on dog. I do know what dog is. Um, but yeah, I was like, well, I mean, at least you know how to say Tiger, I suppose. So here it is, the Arc Ethereum. 
who has now got crazy. I think they're anchors. The bones that jut out the side of the cheekbones are anchors for the muscles because he has a killer bite. Deodon, I think it's a Deodon. I think a Deodon, what it evolved from, or a Deodon evolves from this. Archithem means ancient beast. It's a good name for those large fanged boars. For this long five balls. Uh, while not very smart, the Archetherium has a keen sense of smell, like a modern day wild boar. Well, I. Yeah, like pigs, Archetherium eats almost everything. It hunts, scavenges, and digs for roots. And YouTubers! Oh, God! Uh, oh, look at all the bugs, yes! Uh, fossilized footprints reveal that Archetherium uh, preyed on the Subracodon, an extinct form of rhinoceros. Oh my god, that's... I, it's not even in the game, so I don't even know what Subracodon is. Can we... If I remember, Jim, now, come on. Put it up an image. Is it there? Did I do it? Praise be. Praise be. <laughs> if I did do it. So that's that guy done. Uh, I just want to see this guy. Oh, 740 and 22 attack! I, like, I did invest in this guy because I thought he's get, Like, even though he's a tournament creature, he's still going to be pretty decent. Uh, anything else? Do I have anything maxed up? I want to look at the panky, the panky panky. That one, the hanky panky. Yeah, there, 1,123 and 100. Not bad, not bad. Now, what is the other one? The other, it's like a wolf. Wolf looking thing. It's a super rare. Uh, I probably went past it right at the start, didn't I? There he is. <laughs> so we have four of them and we need to, I mean, I don't even know if it's worth um, getting this, you know, is it better having two level 40s or a level? I mean, that's the thing, when it comes to di or creatures, I should say, in this game, if you're hybridizing them together, which is my word, <laughs> my, my made up word for this process, um, it's always better to get a level 20. Never just get a level 10, because a level 10 is probably either on par with one of them, so, in other words, it's better to just have two level 40s than one level 10 at the hybrid. Um, let's have a look. How does he eat, actually? Is he just going to jump on it? Oh, there he goes! And there's the rock, just uh, keeping it out of sight so we don't get to see a poor dodo getting ripped apart. Oh, that's good. Beautiful. Uh, so, we'll get him. Oh, yeah, Andrew Sargus. I've got loads. Look at that. 977 health on 509. I can't wait to do some battles with these guys. It's gonna be so weird to see like all these low-level creatures that I've never used before all of a sudden up in the high ranks. But yeah, learning Japanese, really good. I did in the morning. I usually do it at night, and I always have to pace. I have to walk around because I just I find I don't think if I'm just sat down. Um but and piano. I've been learning piano now for uh almost a year, I've got to admit. I make slow progress. <laughs> but I, I I mean, I have one lesson, one lesson a, a week, if that, if I'm even in. Because, uh, I mean, I've missed a few just because I've been away on trips and stuff like that. But I, I do make sure that I get my homework done, you know. But uh, yeah, I, I th it's, it's just really interesting. I've, I When I was a kid, I, I used to do keyboard lessons, but that was during break. Uh, in primary school, so I'd rather be outside playing with my friends and then even then I just didn't have the patience Like I hated getting notes wrong hate having the teacher watching you. I hate the whole way that The education system is where it's grades and it's all oh, he's better than you and ah, uh, I just I just really didn't Have the time of day for it. Um, I don't think that's a good way to train or teach children is like okay this guy's better than you it's not necessarily saying that but it technically is like they're they're better than you or, or you're better than them so you'll you'll i don't know i don't know i mean it's one way of teaching kids and it? it's one way there's many many ways but this one apparently seems to work the best anyway we're going to do it we're going to get this creature um get him to level 20. It's, it's, so I've done my piano, I've done my Japanese, early in the morning, or what I say in the morning, what time is it now? It is two o'clock in the afternoon. <laughs> I was up till three last night. I need to get into a better routine. I'm sick of it. I'm sick. Like, the days that I wake up early and I realize, wow, I've got so much done and it's only 12. I, I just hate the feeling of when it's, you know, it's days like this, when I'm like, oh my God, wow. I, it's two o'clock and I've barely done anything. No, don't sell him! Good God, why is that? Like, that, the only reason why sell is on the left is so you accidentally make that mistake and then you're done. 
Because there, books is on the left. Or, you know, except always on the left. Why would except be on the right? Right? Or at least I've always noticed that it's been that way. So here we go at level 31, 367 health and 238 attack. So it's 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 a it's a glass cannon, really. So there we go. Oh no no no! I wanted to see its attack animation. Damn. Well, anyway, here we go. 80 bucks first time. Damn. Close. Close close. But we'll definitely buy another one. See how expensive it is as well, actually. But, I mean, I have 269,000 DNA. I need to do something with it. I really do, because I'm just sat on that. But the thing is, if I'd spent loads of DNA on that Mammotherium hybrid, and it got nerfed, so it has a third of the attack it used to have. I mean, it has more health, but nah. It's, I, I just feel like, what a waste that would have been of DNA. Um, ooh, there he is. He's, he's got, like, Four sets or two sets of ears. So at level 40, yeah, we've seen that. This creature is available now to purchase in the market with DNA. So let's do it. How much is he? 12,000. So he's actually 2,000 DNA cheaper. And for, uh, you know, I think that's okay. I, st I think that Mega Storacus is better, but it's balanced because you're saving 2,000 DNA. You buy five um, Amphir. Amphi what's it called? Archie Amphicoons. Uh, you buy five of those, you get one for free, basically, uh, for the price of Mega Stracus. So, we'll buy another one, 12,000. Really? Oh, it's 300 bucks. Whoa, that's... I did think I'd be at 5,000 bucks, so, so far, this is pretty decent. Okay, that's us see you meet 766 health and 160 attack. And that's not as good so far as a level one of that Pamphicus, the one that was turned into a VIP. Or at least I think it's level one. It might it might be level ten. That thing is just a beast now. So eighty and eighty. Uh, woo, halfway that'll do. It still could take another like two thousand bucks to do this, or at least a couple hundred to get this. We could fail another three more times, I think. Oh, there we go. There. Do you remember on Jurassic Park Builder where you get the dun 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 ba ba ba, and it was the XP. <laughs> I would just be sad if it aged like, oh, just accept coin, just take my coin. So 993 attack, 207 health. Oh, sorry, 993 health, 200, so 1,312 health, 273 attack at level 20. Now it's pretty decent. Yum. That poor dodo didn't stand a chance. <laughs> no. So let's find out. So we get some food. Some call this fusion of the Amphicoon and the Archetherium the Tusked Wolf. You mean Ludia employees do. <laughs> this dangerous mammalian hybrid can run faster than a modern day grizzly bear. I would have thought so. I'd also think it's quite big. So there we go. Get some extra VIP points and some XP. Oh, hold on. We may be able to level up, guys. We're going to level up. We're going to level up because... Whoa, deforestation! Wabash! Level 79, a new expansion done. And, ooh, 20 bucks. Doesn't really reimburse me, does it? So if I was VIP, I would get four times that. Oh, look, <gasps> 15 times the value to help you on your journey. You can get a gold rewards pack and a silver rewards pack for 4.99. You know what? It's not too bad. That's, it's it, it, like for 4.99, which is the price of what a common pack that you can buy for this, four ninety nine for a gold, um, and a silver rewards. So, I mean, uh, there's no bucks in that. It's unfortunate. It's not bad. It's not bad, but that's more of the deals that Ludia should be pushing. Really, not this hundred freaking pounds. That what's that like? Is it is it still a hundred dollars? Because that should be about like hundred and thirty dollars. But I think it'll probably just be. $100, won't it? Because that $130 doesn't sound right. Yes, I'm sure. No, I'm not going to rate it. Thanks anyway. Please rate us later. So now I can excavate. You know what? I'm going to excavate this. I'll excavate that and we'll just leave a big square. Because I don't... I, ooh. Hold on. Wait, is this new? Have they added new areas to go to? <gasps> no! I didn't realize. Oh, bugger me. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. Yeah, because you couldn't excavate there, so they've added extra ones. Ah, it must be because they added extra levels. So now that means that we can do this and get 6,000. <gasps> so these guys haven't changed. Can I use all creatures? No, I, okay, okay. I need to do a battle where I can use Senezo. Four hours left to fight for that? Ooh. Ooh. I mean, what are the prices if, you got, if I somehow got there? Yeah, they're pretty decent. 
dynamite name or dynamic name. <laughs> if we got to legendary, ooh, ooh, that would be pretty decent. But I'm not in four hours. I ain't getting there. I ain't getting there. But uh, ooh, that's good. That's a nice looking pack. I like it. Earth Sharon, only herbivores. You say only herbivores, mm, but your yeah, lumbazalmoxies cannot kill you in one hit. Oops, I thought it would. Ah, my bad. Okay, let's let's win this pack, but we'll definitely give the uh, new creature a shot and also have a look at the new lineup. So you should have two, right? Yes. Bam! Corner after taken out. Easy win. Right, okay. Next one. That was easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Ne oh, is it all herbivores? Look at those guys. I mean, Enosaurus isn't too great, but we've got way more attack. Sorry, way more health. Like, what? What is that? Four times the health? And now almost three times the health, still. <laughs> so one, two... I think he went for enough, didn't he? Yeah. Okay, so that, that should kill him. Shazam! Ostrophrigosaurus has... Ooh, the same! We're gonna win the Ostrophrigosaurus, guys! Oh my god! <laughs> we haven't... I don't have- I really need one of those! It's been years! I've waited so long! The best carnivore in the game! And now we're gonna get it right here only like 20 years after the game released. We're gonna get a herbivores three! One, two, and a three! And I have Stegoceratops level 40 now! Took me long enough, but we got there. Good excuse to do it. Uh, so we can kill him in two, but you know what? I'm just gonna go for all the reserves. That's pretty- at this point, all I need to do, just put loads of reserves in, and we're golden. Don't need to worry about it. Uh, we'll go for two, factor in two, and then two reserves, because why not? Uh, there it is! Wabash! <laughs> Killed him! Dead! Right, he's got six. That's enough to kill me. Oh, he goes for it! No! Blue boy! Ooh, how dare you! Well, I can go for two and then four reserves, and we've pretty much done it. Yep, don't need to worry. We've still got two more battles. It's something that they haven't changed is the the amount of battles. Uh, need to really fix that. Oh my god, he's killed me! Oh! But he went for everything, I think. Stiggy Moloch, there we go, that fan favorite from Fallen Kingdom. That's a point. So we got. With the new Jurassic World movie that's coming out next year, is it? Or is it two years' time? 90, yeah, 2021, I think it is. Wow, it was only a year ago Fallen Kingdom came out. Jeez. Or over a year now. Uh, yeah, they, they, for whatever reason, they're bringing back the characters from Fallen Kingdom. It's in the um, Zara and I can't remember the other guy's name. Uh, is it Justice... Is it Justice Smith? Is, it, is that... Is that um, the actor's name, or is that Will Smith's son? <laughs> I don't think. It, well, anyway, they're, they're bringing back um, those, the vet and the the quote in quotations nerd. Um, I personally don't know why they are doing this. Why they are bringing those guys back? I really don't know. Um, I would, I mean, they're bringing, they're, so the characters that we're going to have for Fallen, for the final movie, the final Jurassic World movie, Alan Grant, Dr. Sattler, Dr. Ian Malcolm, or uh, Dr. Alan Grant, uh, Chris Pratt, Owen, you know, Owen Grady, um, Claire Deering, uh, Maisie, Zara, the, the, the guy I can't remember the name of, they're bringing back so, all, there's like so many characters, and that's not even including all the other ones, that, you know, aren't like technically main characters. I really, I don't know, I, I'm, I'm anxious, I'm anxious, because I'm anxious that I'm also not, because I feel at this point now, I'm, I'm so distant from the movies, um, from what I, you know, was wanting, or anything like that. But we did it, Ostrigosaurus, Carnivore Pack, in it gorgeous, look at it, da 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 da. Uh, 500, oh, 200 buckaroos! <gasps> and 325 VIP points, which would be what? 1,200? And <gasps> oh my god, this creature is now available to purchase! <laughs> we did it, guys! We did it! We've unlocked Ostrophrigosaurus finally! Good lord! <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Uh, we got Battle Survivor, but this must be it. Okay, wow! 
Okay, how you done I expected. I did not expect to see Smith to carry us all the way up here. And we have two level 20s. <gasps> oh, wow. Okay. Um, I think I bought more as well, actually. Or at least I bought one. Andrew Sarkis is weird up here. Any other ones that are weird up here? Oh, there he is. The, the two level 20s. Really not on par, are they? So, what, what, what do we need? We need caverns. That's what we need here. We need some good caverns. So, Hyenodon, Titanoboa. Is this three battles? Oh my god, it's four battles? Are you serious? Okay, we'll only do one. We'll only do one. Actually, you know what? I'll fast forward. I'll fast forward to the final battle, shall we? Let's do that. <laughs> Look at all- Ooh, the bear wins! But that's it. <laughs> so just, just turn to the camera. There you go. The charge from the bro, The brosaurus. Whoosh. Yeah. Right, there you go. That's the second final. So now we're on to the final battle. All of the DNA. Onto the no restrictions. Okay. So what I'm thinking is we can fuse the amazing uh, VIP creature that we've got for free. Because there's so many of them. We've got like... 1,123 health, right? 189 attack, and then level 10, 1,685 health, and 284 attack. Um, so it's like 180, well, yeah, 40, even 47 bucks isn't much. VIP creatures are the best. They've got so much attack, they take, well, depends. I don't know how much, how often they fail, but if they're lower level, they shouldn't, but it is like half the bucks, though. Remember that as a normal, like, creature. And you don't really technically have to do this. You should just wait. <gasps> He's going to appear. Whoa! There he is. 368 so far. Get him to 486 attack. Wow. And that's an only level 20. We could, in we could get him to a level 30. And in fact, I'm going to get two level 20s because it, it would be stupid to not do that. Ah, oh, and first time. There we go. So now let's go in. Get him to level 20. At least I'm using my food as well. So that's two level 20s instead of like 20 level 1s. Pankosus, or pa was it Panachuthus? Panachuthus lived in a current day South America during the the Pleistocene era. <laughs> Pan Panthichus uh, could reach up to 9 feet, 3 meters in length, and weigh up to 3,330 pounds. And if you didn't know, that is one heavy boy. So, what are, we, what are we doing? We got some coin. That's fine. We probably got some super DNA, but we'll collect it with this next one. The final one. Now, where is he? Whoa, he's right there. And we could fuse him again, and he'd be even higher. So, what, what are we wanting to use? Wanting to use one of those. Um, but I may as use Mammoth Theorem, and may as use the Mastodon. Mammoth is nowhere in sight. So, because we've got the type advantage, we may as well go for one reserve right off the bat. Because you'll probably have to switch. <gasps> Woo! Oh dear! Proctothurium! Pretty scary. Scary stuff. Hopefully he goes for a block. He did. Fantastic. We've survived. I'm going to switch into my Mastodon, I think. And I'm just going to try and kill this thing. Because I want this Pankachars to survive. So, actually, tell you what. We'll just go for loads of reserves. Well, there we go. We've got four reserves off. So whatever comes in next has eight. And even if we don't have the type advantage, we'll be able to switch out and then have the type advantage and then have seven. So, oh, he doesn't. Are you kidding me? One, two, one, two, and then have four. So there we go. And he's dead. <laughs> and we've got eight on the next turn. Ooh, do you kill us in two hits? <gasps> I think you might. So he's probably going to go for six. Yep, there you go. It's what it's all about. Oh, the tail. Oh, the whap -ba. Oh, the twerk. It was too much for the poor elephant. And uh, Mammoth Theorem. Oh, that was lucky. I didn't even mean for that to happen. We've got the type advantage here. Uh, we can go for three and that'll kill him, but may, may as well go for one extra and have four reserves. Then his advantage comes in, the Marsupial Lion, which means it has a pouch, I think, right? Marsupials all have pouches? Or do they... Is it Marsupials they give birth to really young, young? So, like, tiny fetuses. Is that it? Is that what distincts marsupials? Or do they have thumbs? I don't know. I will for anyway. <laughs> We're not getting into that. Whoa, the twirl and spin. Oh, there you go. We don't, because we, we're speeding up the animation. We don't get to see it. <laughs> oh. 
Oh, yeah, I didn't use my new creature. Okay, let's be fair. It wasn't too great. I, I didn't have a good opportunity. Oh, with only a thousand books to spin again. Oh, you generous. But yeah, he's, he's not really too great. So, but at least we do have him. And there we go. 20, 20, 20. So, I mean, we're nowhere near, are we? Are we, are we near anywhere of getting them? So, I think we need 2,000 for Caprasuchus, I think. I could be wrong. Let's have a look. We'll go into hatchery. We'll go into super hybrids. We might have? No, we need more for that. We definitely need more Monostego. Uh, Spandesuchus. We need 2,000. So we're 400 away from that. And Tappy Jello. We need... How much? 2,000 as well. Uh, Indoraptor. Or you can get it from the Century Pack. 5%. That's actually really good. Interruptor's way better than all of these. Actually, Metrophodon's pretty darn good. And apart from anything else, yeah, Metrophodon's the one you want to get. But you're probably going to get... Oh, if you got Coolosaurus, that would suck. Or you're an... You're in... Une Ranchus. If you got Une Ranchus, that would suck as well. You want that Indoraptor or the Metrophodon. Bye, Galasaurus. Me oh, also, before we go, they have changed... They didn't even mention it, I don't think. But they've changed the model for this guy. Now, if you look here... You can see his old model, like the head is very dome-like, but if we click on it, are you ready? Ah, oh, look at that, they've made the, um, the crest, so his head is no longer domed, and then goes up to form a crest, it's just like slanted, so it's more streamlined, and I think it's wider as well. Uh, I mean, you can see, if you look at this picture in comparison to the model, that's what the model used to look like, is that picture. And the head is completely changed now. Interesting little change. I don't know why they did it, but they've done it. So, there we go, guys. Before we reach, like, 40 crazy minutes. Oh, also, who may as well collect all the coin. Whoa! 99! Um, I think we'll have a quick look in the trade harbor. You never know. There you go. Eight bucks. That's what we needed, really. Uh, and a fire pit for 54 DNA. I'll take that. Uh, anything else that's worth it? That's kind of not worth it. We'll trade coin for DNA, because why not? 211 DNA. And we'll claim... Is there anything that I've missed, I feel? Uh, oh yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa! What's this? Legendary lineup. Whoa, what? Less than 1% and less legendary glaze? Whoa, these are new packs. Rare rogues? What'd you, what'd you get in this? You get... Coin, D guaranteed coin, guaranteed DNA, and then a guaranteed rare. So what'd you get from the legendaries? Coin, DNA, uh, so no bucks. You don't get any bucks from these, which is, I mean, it costs bucks to enter. And you're going to get one of those, possibly. These are all less than 1%. In fact, the chances of you getting it, since e anything that's even a rare is less than 1%, uh, and coin is 29%. You, you've got just as much chance of winning an undersuit just as you do as the legend. In fact, actually, it might even be smaller. Just because it's less than 1% doesn't mean it's equal. It could be 0.00001%. And then the rare could be 0.01%. So it could be in a really low... Um, it could exactly be like that 1%. Uh, micro SDNAs. Ooh, what's this? Legendary floods. <gasps> Super swimmers. Super swimmers. So, what's Legendary Floods? Oh, it's, all right, it's Legendary Creatures. Again, less than 1%. But, ah, there's actually a reason to do that. And what about this? The Micro SDF. 5% chance of getting that. That's, that's way bigger. And then, you you got 15% chance of getting those guys. So, if you do want to harvest, so... Mono, Sarko, and Raptor. And if you would use this one, Mono, Sarko, Raptor. Interesting. Is there any Super DNA that you're not getting? Mono, Sarko, Raptor... Caprasuchus you're not getting anymore. Caprasuchus is gone. You still get Eupocephalus from the uh, the missions. You still get that. Hmm. So Caprasuchus is gone. Is there anything that you get for VIPs? Complete a battle event, VIP exclusive event. So that's 12. Uh, complete battle event, VIP exclusive event. That's another 12. Uh, how many events are there for VIPs? Oh, there's two of these. Ooh, interesting. But it's five battles. You know what I mean? It's five battles. They need, like, uh, 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 just tone it down. Tone it down with the battles. There's too much. 
Like, you want people to look at it and go, like, I look at that Battle for Survival and go, oh, awesome, three. It used to be two, I think. But I think three, great. I can bang that. I five minutes, I've got five minutes. Let's do that. I look at something that's five battles, like, oh, my God. And even then, this VIP battle event will be really hard creatures, so... Anyway, I said before we got to 40 minutes, but again, thanks for watching this video. I do appreciate all the videos that you watch of mine. Uh, it, like, really helps support the channel, support me, and uh, in whatever things that I just, you know, we decide to do in future. Uh, it's a shame that because there's Copa, if you don't know what Copa is, um, unboxings will probably stop on the channel. Um, but apart from that, it shouldn't affect too much else. It's it's just kind of scary. It's a really scary thing. If you don't know much about it, maybe I'll talk about it in another video. Uh, right now, we need to go and enjoy this video. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Until next time, I'll see you later. Uh, bye bye.